This is Mato. In this video, I will show you the game between Varus Henakobian and Imed Abdel Nabi. This game was played in Abu Dhabi in the year 2000. And where is Abu Dhabi? Abu Dhabi is the capital city of the United Arab Emirates. In this game, Akobian had white pieces and he started with d4. Abdel Nabi played knight to f6 c4, e6, knight to c3, and black played bishop to b4, Ninzo, Indian defense, e3, Rubenstein, variation, c5, knight to e2, so if bishop takes knight, knight takes bishop, c takes on d4, e takes on d4, d5, a3, and now not taking the knight, bishop to e7, knight to f4, Abdel Nabi castled kingside. C takes on d5. Knight takes on d5. Knight takes knight. Pawn takes knight. Bishop to d3, aiming at h7. Knight to c6. Akobian castled kingside. Bishop to g5. Bishop to e3. Both players followed the mine line. It is black to move. Abdel Nabi played. Queen to d6. Pressure is on the knight on f4. The most played move in this position is bishop takes knight on f4. We have queen to d6, knight to h5, queen to h6. Alternative was bishop takes bishop, then pawn takes bishop, and after say rook to e8, queen to f3. In the game we have a queen to h6, queen to f3, bishop to e6, rook from a to d1. It is black to move. Abdel Nabi played knight to a5. Perhaps better was rook from f to e8, bringing the rook on the weapon file. Knight to a5 was played. It appears that this move did not improve Black's position. And there is a saying, Knight on the rim is dim. Knight to f4. Hmm. As if white knight heard me. Rook from a to d8. Rook from f to e1. Bishop to d7. Is this setting a little trap? Black allowed white to get a pawn on d5. Knight takes on d5. Bishop to a4, attacking the rook. Rook to b1. Rook to d7. Bishop takes bishop, queen takes bishop. White knight on d5 is attacked by two pieces. How would you continue if you had white pieces? If, for example, knight to e3, then rook takes on d4. Akobian played the best move, defending and attacking at the same time. Queen to d2. We have reached a very interesting position with white to move. What would you do? Please pause the video and try to find the best move for white. Ready? What did you find? Would you play this? Akobian sacrificed the bishop for the attack. King takes bishop. Rook to h5 check. King to g8. White to move. How would you continue the attack on black king? Perhaps queen to h3 comes to mind, what do you think? Then f6. Rook to h8, check. King to f7, check. King to e6, knight to f4. This looks good for white too, doesn't it? Akobian found even more brilliant continuation. 
knight to f6 check pawn takes knight queen to g4 check and black queen said you will get my king only over my dead body rook takes queen pawn takes rook check king to h7 queen takes knight on a5 black resigned one sensible line goes like this rook takes on d4 b4 threatening queen takes bishop if for example bishop to c2 then queen to c5 forking two pieces after bishop takes rook queen takes rook on d4 attacking the pawn on a7 after b6 perhaps just in case f4 and white should be able to win easily very interesting game isn't it and did you find the killer move at move 23 in this position bishop takes on h7 check king takes check and did you find the second move if you did congratulations and that is all i hope that you enjoyed watching this video i wish you good luck with your king hunt and